This person encountered something strange while diving in Norway. They said the following. I'm currently a retired diver with over 25 years experience. Over the course of my career I've seen some strange things. However, one of the weirdest was when I was diving in Norway. I used to go diving with my friend as he too was experienced. On this particular day it was clear and we decided to go diving. At the time we'd been visiting our friend in Norway. We were diving close to the fjords, and this was an area we knew quite well. Over the last few years we found shipwrecks among other things. As we began to set up it was just me and my close friend Ben who would be going down there. This was while our other friend would stay up on the boat. As we dived in we started to explore the surroundings. Every time we dive we always try and explore a new location. After around 20 minutes I can see my friend using hand gestures to call me over. I see him pointing at what appears to be a large mound of dirt on the sea floor. However as I start to focus I can see that it looks like an object had crashed here. You can see where something is skidded along the sea floor. As we went towards the sea floor we got a good idea of how wide this mark was. Estimating by using our body we guessed it was over 20 feet in diameter. One of the reasons we said it was a skid mark is because we followed the trail of dirt and estimated it was around 90 to 150 meters long. We couldn't think of any object that would make this and something that threw us off is that there was nothing at the end of the trail. It was as if something had crashed and then disappeared. As we got close to the sea floor we could see shiny objects embedded inside the trail. My friend collected some of this and we decided to head back to the boat. After reaching the surface and getting on board we told our other friend about what we'd found. However he said it was most likely a boat crash. We then told him there was no boat at the end of the trail and he said it was most likely retrieved. After this trip I headed back home to the US and started to forget about the whole experience. Then a few weeks later I got a phone call from my friend who collected the sample. He told me that he had extracted some of the shiny material and that it was unlike anything he'd seen before. He told me that it was a reflective material and that it was very durable. He tried to break it with a hammer but couldn't and he even tried to burn it but this didn't damage it either. He still has the sample and we both have no idea what it could be from. So what do you guys make of this story? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.